we all know that it's really important to stay hydrated and that being dehydrated is not a good thing. So let's look at what being dehydrated is. It is simply losing more fluid than you're taking in. And how do we lose it? Well, obviously by sweating and peeing. And then if you don't drink enough water, you can easily become dehydrated. Why is it so important to be hydrated? Well, two thirds of the body is made up of water and that water lubricates our joints, our eyes, it helps aid digestion, and it also flushes out um, waste and toxins, among many, many other things. So it really is important. And obviously, if you become dehydrated, then none of that's going to work properly. So it's important that we drink enough water. And, and I like plain old simple flat water, not fizzy water. To me, nothing is going to hydrate you quite as well as just plain good old water. Um, the other thing is, which I've always, always said, um, and is in um, the InSync Diet book that I wrote with uh, nutritionist Fleur Borelli, is that it's good uh, to drink when thirsty and drink big glasses of water, because if you have little sips through the day, you're, never, you're not going to fully hydrate your cells. But the other thing that's important with hydration is electrolytes. So it's about hydrating yourself is about having enough water with the appropriate balance of electrolytes. And when we think of electrolytes, um, I think we often think of sports drinks and um, things like that. And, and sports drinks usually are full of sugar and additives and all kinds of things that make them extremely unhealthy. So how do you get electrolytes? naturally. Well, you can get a little electrolyte uh, drinks that you can add to your water, which will help fully hydrate them. But today I wanted to show you a very simple little hack. It's something that I do every single day. And, and this is how I start every day. And the first thing I do way before I have a coffee or a tea, I get a glass of water, I get half a lemon and I squeeze that lemon into the water. You can also do this with a lime, which is really, really nice because fruit and vegetables actually do contain electrolytes. And then the piece de resistance is a little bit of sea salt, not processed salt. It has to be sea salt, natural salt. And then you just put a pinch of that into the water and voila, you have a fully uh, electrolyted drink. Uh, this is a great way to start the day because also uh, while we're asleep at night we sweat even even in winter even in winter we sweat and um, so that it's really important to have a, probably a couple of glasses of water uh, when you wake up but this is what I do I sit in bed every morning and I have this and, and then I get up and maybe then I'll have a coffee or uh, maybe I'll exercise and then I'm all set for the day. So that's a great way to make sure that um, you're having a drink that's going to really hydrate you and hydrate your cells.